Welcome to a CRMStage.com user tutorial. In this tutorial we're going to look at the Get Social Twitter Pro search dashlet. With the Get Social Twitter Pro search dashlet, marketing personnel can monitor PR and branding efforts, support can monitor for potential cases, and sales can monitor for leads. Let's take a look at the dashlet. We're using Sugar CRM Community Edition. So to add our search dashlet, we'll click the Add Sugar Dashlets button, browse to the Tools tab, and choose Twitter Search. As you see, it's loaded in the background. We'll close this screen to get it out of our way, and then we'll reload the window. Let's start with a search for Sugar CRM. Now that these are loaded, let's say that we're in a support or sales role. I can monitor the Sugar CRM tweets or whatever brand that I'm looking for or what keyword that I might be searching for and find out if any need to be converted to a lead or case. To do that, I can simply check the checkbox to the left hand side of any tweet then click the import button. This now goes into the tweets module where it can be converted to a case or lead. The reason that this functionality is separated into two areas is so that many people can use the search dashlet to monitor and import data but a designated person can decide whether the tweet needs to be converted into that lead or case. So it's a separation of duties. In the future, the separation of these duties may likely be an optional feature that you can enable or disable. When you go into the Tweet module, you'll see that the data has been imported. Now that it's been imported into Tweet module, a user can click to convert the tweet to a lead or they can convert it to a case. Let's go back over to the search dashlet again. If you're in marketing and you'd like to monitor competitors as well as yourself, then you can add multiple search dashlets. By going in, I simply add the Twitter search dashlet again. It'll populate in the background as it did before. I can then reload the window and type in my search term. So let's say I'm at a marketing automation company like Pardot. I'm going to type in Pardot here so that I can monitor my brand. And then I may want to look at a competitor such as Silverpop. So I'll type Silverpop into this box. And I can monitor that as well. One thing to be careful of is adding too many dashlets. If, since Twitter only allows a certain number of API calls, if you add too many dashlets across the user name that's being used, then you can run out of calls to the Twitter API and it's going to lock up for the rest of the day and not allow you to make any more calls to that until they allocate more to your account. Now that you know how to use the Get Social Twitter Pro search dashlet, go try it out for yourself and if you have any questions, please feel free to contact us.